Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Kerbal Space Program video. I know it's been a while, but I've been very busy in studying for my certifications for my job. But now I'm back for now, so let's get started. So I figured it's been a while, and I wanted to go ahead and clean up the actual craft files inside the history. I only kept the ones that I thought were important, like some sort of uh, historical landmark in a sense. To show, to show when the uh, vehicle or the craft file had diverged into a different type of uh, design. I did this because of the fact that there is a lot of variations of the same craft. So instead of keeping all 7, 8, 9, 10 different variations, I only keep the one. Like the very first one that was ever made of the type of craft or the chassis. So once I cleaned all that up, I wanted to make a four passenger SSTO. Because of the fact that we are playing a type of hardcore career mode, we need a way to we need a way to make money. So ultimately the design had to be easy to use, easy to launch, easy to fly, and easy to return back to the Kerbal Space Center. Because if you're able to land this thing near the roadway, or near the runway, excuse me, you'll get more bang for your buck when it comes time to bring the SSTO back in. The further away you are from the KSC, like landing a craft for instance, the less money you get back. So it is imperative that you try to land as close if not right on top of the runway or landing pad as possible. Because this thing doesn't have any gears, because the gears that we have unlocked right now suck, it launches vertically and lands in the water. Preferably the water that's right next to the runway or as close as possible.
Now, if you're interested in the research and development part of this vehicle, it, you can find it in my channel in the uh, streaming or under streaming streams stuff. For the past couple of weeks, I have been streaming uh, basically a very, a very easy stream of, of flying this type of craft and others as well that I will be covering later in the week. All in all, it came out really well and I'm very happy with it. So thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for being part of the channel. If you liked what you saw, please leave a like. And if you loved what you saw, consider subscribing. We also have a membership program if you become member get cool little emojis and badges and stuff next game pretty cool check it out anyway that is it for today i'll see you all in the next video bye for now